Hey, aloha. Welcome back to Practical Printing. Uh, man, I am fresh back from Maker Faire Bay Area 2017, and I tell you, it was an epic, epic weekend. Um, I got to meet Angus all the way from Australia. Maker Noob and his wife were here from Malta. Um, Jeff from the 3D Print Channel came out from Vegas. Great to meet up with him finally. Uh, Joel and Dustin were there. Barnacles, um, Mitch, Chuck Hellebeck, Lauren from A Buzz Design and her husband, uh, Travis and Heather from A Pyro Design. Um, I, make it with Calvin. I mean, so many people, I can't even name them all off. I don't have enough fingers and toes, but it was great to finally meet everybody face to face, uh, the ones that I haven't met in, before. Unfortunately, between there and here, my SD card that I had filmed all the footage of the show had gotten corrupted. So I was able to salvage as much as I can. And unfortunately, I don't have a lot of product or a lot of boosts to show you. Um, so what I have is mostly just a montage for you, some of it in high speed just to get you through it quicker, just to show you the size and the scope of how big the Maker Faire was. I mean, it was just huge. And it took up the entire county fairgrounds up there. Um, one of the ones that I was able to salvage, though, that I wanted to point out was T3D. Now, anybody that's been following Ono, the resin printer that uses a cell phone as a base, um, is pretty much convinced that it is vaporware at this point. Uh, they were not showing working product in their booth. And a lot of us had asked them, take us, take us to a back room, you know, after the show, before the show, we'll come in early. We just want to see one layer print, one layer. And they wouldn't show us anything working. So it's vaporware, period. Until, until they show us otherwise, it's vaporware. All that being said, T3D was showing over in the smaller section of the fair under the new products, the up and coming companies, um, right by Piopoli and Moai, who also had a wonderful, successful Kickstarter. And uh, uh, the Obsidian was being shown over there by Kodama. Um, ANSI Labs was showing the new version of the Smart VL Touch. Um, if you ever get a chance to meet Paris, she's also wonderful. She's one of my heroes in the, in the industry because she came out of nowhere with just a great product that's, that's affordable and it's changing the way everybody's printing in FDM. Um, she, she made auto leveling or bed leveling or bed compensation, whatever we want to call it. She made it easy. Anyway, so T3D, um, I left the audio in from what the, what the gentleman there was telling me. They are showing a cell phone printer that works. It was working in the booth. Um, and they've taken it a step further, and they're actually doing multi-color resin printing from a cell phone. So they've come up with a mechanism that spins the trays to allow you to use three different color resins in three different trays. And that same mechanism also doubles as a 3D scanner. So it's a really clever device. So check out T3D. Make sure you listen up for them. Most of the rest of the audio I've kind of cut out, added some music in just to... Um, so you didn't have to hear the fair noise because it was really loud and overbearing. So with that, let me take you to the clips I was able to salvage, and I hope you enjoy Maker Fair Bay Area 2017. <laughs>
your smartphone or tablet screen light to make the real circuit solid. Okay. Yeah, so it's, it's more like sensitive progressive. Okay. Yeah. So and similar to what Mono? Yeah, similar to Mono. But we come out first, actually. Okay. Yeah. Now, do you guys have a working unit in the booth? That we are doing one. Yeah. Those work. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and we also uh, have a kit for this printer. It allow you to do the most color printing. Oh, oh wow! So you can do more color. Oh, it's the three different yeah, things. So you can uh, take a photo from your phone. Right now, I'm just showing you how you print. Uh, 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 how you